Hi everyone, thanks for tuning in. This is a Taurus reading for all Sun, Moon, Rising and Venus signs and also cross watchers as well. Thank you everyone for watching. So I've done a pre-shuffle already so we can jump straight into this reading. So I'll start with the messages from the Angel Answers. So we have abundance. We have helpful people. Ask your angels and meditation brings answers. So the messages for this reading is abundance, helpful people, ask your angels and meditation brings answers. Okay, so I'll get the tarot, tap into the energies surrounding the situation during this time. Do a free card spread. See what spirit wants you to know. We've got the Two of Cups, we've got the Ace of Swords and Ten of Wands. So let's clarify. We've got the Emperor, you could be dealing with the Aries. We've got the Four of Wands, Ten of Swords. So that's further clarified with the Nine of Wands. We've got the Hermit, Virgo energy. You could be dealing with a Virgo. And we've got the Queen of Pentacles. So that is Taurus energy. Okay, so uh, yeah, I can see... Um, there's, there's about to be a moment of breakthrough in this situation here. If there hasn't been already, if there hasn't been a breakthrough already, there's about to be. In this situation here, you've got with someone. Truth and clarity. So, yeah, it looks like you're about to get truth and clarity in the situation here. So that's good. Yeah, it looks like um, this person wants to talk to you. It looks like you've got a connection with this person. Like a spiritual connection, soulmate. We've got the four of ones here. So for some of you, you may have a twin flame connection with this person. But the Four of Wands is in reverse, so I can see there is an imbalance in this connection you, that you have here. Yeah, Two of Cups is in reverse. Two of Cups in reverse. So yeah, there's an imbalance in this connection between you and this person. Doesn't look like you guys are seeing eye to eye right about now. I feel like um, one of you's given up. Got the nine of wands in reverse. It's like someone's given up here. Giving up the fight. <laughs> yeah. So it looks like uh, this is a situation that was draining. Someone felt like this situation was a burden. Got the ten of wands here. Ten of wands in reverse. Yeah, someone's letting the situation go. Ten of Swords. There was betrayal here in this situation. This is what it is. So I feel like... I feel like this person that wants to talk to you here, I feel like... Um, you may have felt betrayed by this person. This is someone that you may have felt like stabbed you in the back. So, uh, I'm guessing, I'm guessing there was someone else. I feel like there was someone else in the picture. This is what it is. This is someone that 
was seeing someone else, they had another connection or relationship with someone else. They may have chose to be with someone else over you. But yeah, this is someone that I feel like they didn't do right by you. With this Ten of Swords, I feel like um, you're getting over it. You're getting over the betrayal by this person here. I feel like um, for some of you, you felt like this this relationship or connection that you have with this person is a burden. You're letting it go. Yeah, and you're healing. You're healing from it. I feel like, yeah, you're still um, able to pick up yourself and carry on. I mean, as painful as it may have been, you're still able to cope. Yeah, and stay focused here. Yeah. It looks like, uh, yeah, you're focused. Focus on yourself. We've got Queen of Pentacles here. So I can see someone's focused here on like their goals. Focus on, you know, family, career, home life. Yeah. Moving on here. But it looks like this person, they actually want to talk to you. This Ace of Swords here. So I feel like um, whoever they were seeing, I feel like they split up. Because I could see on the flip side of things, you know, this is someone that was... They were seeing someone else and it looks like they've split up with that person here or they're on the verge of breaking up with that person with this two of cups in reverse here. Yeah, because uh, I feel like this person, yeah, they're letting it go. I feel like this person was was seeing someone else, but they they feel this strong connection with you. Because I feel like it's a strong, you know, soulmate connection you have with this person here. I feel like you and this person are in separation. We've got the hermit here. You're in separation because I feel like there was a third party interference. This is someone that was seeing someone else. And maybe this is why you felt betrayed here. You felt like this person betrayed the connection with you. Yeah. So it looks like um I feel like this this person's heart is with you at the end of the day. So whoever they were seeing outside of you here, uh it was inevitable that it will come to an end because I feel like this person's heart is with you because you guys have this strong connection here. I mean, we've got an emperor showing up in this reading. It's like, you know, this is a, a divine counterpart here. For some of you, this could be like um, your child's father. The emperor represents a father figure. But I feel like um, their heart is with you at the end of the day. And um, I feel like they're ready to be honest with you about how they feel. Because we've got the Ace of Swords here. So there's there's some sort of clarity. Someone wants to bring clarity into in this situation here. They want to talk and discuss the issues in this connection it looks like so that may help this situation right about now it looks like some truth and clarity i feel like it will uh, make you see things differently it will help both of you to see things differently this is why we have helpful people i feel yeah i feel like um 
this clarity here will help both of you see see the situation a lot better you know i feel like it will clear up any misunderstandings that you guys may have in this situation here because that may be the issue in this uh, connection is communication so i feel like it will help this is why we have helpful people i feel like this person needs your help <laughs> yeah the message says that um This card indicates that your situation requires the input of those who can assist you in accomplishing the task before you. This may include professionals in fields related to your question or others who work for or around you. It could also include people in your personal life who have experience that would be useful. This card lets you know that someone will be entering your life soon who can help make your dreams come true. Yes, helpful people. So yeah, this situation requires um your assistance. It requires someone's assistance here. I feel like this person wants to talk to you because they want your help. They need your help with something here. I feel like this person needs your help to make their dreams come true. <laughs> I feel like this person really wants to be with you. This is what I'm saying. With the hermit here, I really feel like this hermit feels lonely without you. This energy, this lonely energy, is someone that feels really lonely and isolated. I can see this is someone that wants to reconnect with you here. Yeah. I feel like that will be their dream. This is This, this is their dream. This person wants you to help them make their dreams come true. This is what I can see. So um, I really feel like at this point, this person, I feel like they're ready to heal the situation with you. I feel like as much as you're hurt in this situation, I feel like this person's hurt as well. I feel like they want to bring healing to this situation here. It's a burden. Someone's ready to let go of, you know, thoughts or people, situations that's no longer serving them, you know. Anything that's been holding this person back or stressing this person out, they're ready to let it go and just focus on healing, you know, and moving forward here. But this person knows... They need to release some baggage here. I feel like they're ready to release release their baggage here. I feel like if there was a relationship that wasn't serving someone here, someone's they're ready to let that go. Someone's letting it go here and moving forward. It looks like that's the right thing to do. I mean, either way it goes, whoever's moving forward, ready to make changes in their life, I feel like it's the right thing to do because we have abundance here. Abundance is coming in. So whatever you're planning to do, whatever you're focused on, what goals you're focused on right now, I feel like um, it will it will bring in a lot of prosperity here. So it could be, you know, you want to manifest a new career or romance or friends, a large circle of friends, health, whatever you want to manifest, whatever you're plan planning to do moving forward, it is going to bring in a lot of prosperity. So I feel like remain focused here. So, yeah, it's all about remaining focused on what you want to achieve during this time. And, uh, yeah, stay connected to your angels. Ask your angels. They are always with you. Meditate, because meditation brings answers here. So the answers to any problems or questions you have is within. Your angels are there to assist you. 
so i'll leave it here for now you guys i hope this reading helps thank you so much for watching please like share and subscribe and i'll see you soon bye for now